This is Robert Estrin here at livingpianos.com, your online piano resource with a wonderful Mason & Hamlin Model A, five foot eight inch grand piano from the golden era of Mason & Hamlin's history, 1917. Mason & Hamlin was actually bought by the Aeolian Piano Company in the early 1930s as many piano companies suffered with the Great Depression, the advent of radio, piano sales were not the same at that point. And the pianos before that period are some of the most revered American pianos of all time. And the Model A is an incredible example of Mason and Hamlin's history. And this is a rebuilt piano, the complete action, pin block strings, refinished the works. Want you to hear three selections here, three different period styles, starting off with a little bit of Mozart. Just the exposition of his K330 C major sonata for you. I know you could hear the warm, rich sound. I wish you could feel the smoothness of the action. You know, there are many things that are involved in rebuilding pianos. And when you see the word rebuilt, you might wonder what's been done. Well, sometimes pianos that are rebuilt, they're just restrung and refinished. But in this case, the thousands of action parts have been meticulously replaced with the best quality components for obel hammers, new shanks, knuckles, Whippings, repetitions, there are a lot that goes into it. And when everything comes out right, it is such a pleasure to play. So let's hear some more music. Let's hear it opens up with a, an etude of Heller. I love teaching this piece, and it's a short piece that shows a lot in a little bit out of time. It's number nine in the Shermer edition Heller book, for those of you who want to reference it.
a delightful little piece. You know what's great about this piano is that you can get a tremendous dynamic range because no matter how loudly you play, it's always a beautiful, warm, round sound. And on the flip side, when playing delicately, all the nuances of touch come out because of the beautifully rebuilt action, the new strings, pin block. So I'm going to play for you the B minor prelude of Chopin to explore those sonorities for you. So there you have it, a Mason Hamlin Model A, five foot eight inch grand piano that sounds like a far larger piano. There are a lot of things that go into it, from the wide tail that allows for a larger soundboard area than other pianos of the same size. Did you know that Mason and Hamlin pianos weigh more than other pianos? This piano weighs more than 200 pounds more than a similar, similar size Steinway piano. That's easy to say. So what does that mean? It means that the inner and outer rims have more mass. It supports the soundboard, which is why Mason and Hamlin pianos hold up so well. Not to mention the famous spider. The spider is the tension resonator system, which is a metal bracing. As if the massive frame of this piano isn't enough, they overbuild these pianos to last for generations and make excellent candidates for rebuilding because of that reason. I'm interested in your opinion of this piano and any questions, you can address them to me, Robert at livingpianos.com. Thanks so much for joining me and all you subscribers. We'll see you next time.